thank you so much for um, coming on this call with me. And the uh, thing about addiction, when you use the word addiction, is addiction. Okay, a means lack of. In English, it means lack of. Negative, negative of. Negative of addiction. So the pro reason why these people are having that alcohol addiction is because they don't have proper diction. They are not taught in the school how to speak properly. So the point here is that uh, people need to take care of their diction. And that has to start from an early age, like three, four, five, and six. And then those people who grow up with proper diction, and which is like meditation, centered speech, you know, people who grow up with that, they will not have these problems when they grow up. Okay, but the pro people who are already having the problems, okay, they need to take classes, meditation centering classes, okay, where they learn to center themselves, their own body. All of these things are coming because they are not centering themselves. Okay, meditation, but medi just means middle. It is Latin for middle, which came from Sanskrit. Madhya, medi, middle. So if you come to the center in your body, you get free from addictions. Okay. So it is a big medicine. The word medicine also has medi. Meditation also has medi. It's all coming to the center. Okay. So these people need to be taught that. And nobody is teaching that. You know, that is not being taught. So even when people are going to these places where they have to, you know, get rid of their addiction, alcohol addiction, you know, they can go to this council that things people give them advice and people give them uh, all this. They talk to them, but no one tells them the solution. Solution is within your own body. Okay. The solution is within your own body. You center your body, you center your posture, you center your speech. And within a month or two, it's like magic. <laughs> you don't want that al alcohol. It's 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 more than magic. Wow. Yeah. That's that's so fascinating. Um, yes, just yes. a question, if if you have a moment. Um, so going deeper though, why would it? How? Why would a lack of proper diction drive a person to drink, for instance, or to smoke? Okay. What's okay when you are not centered? Uh, your mind is not under your control. Okay, so the mind is always like a pendulum, like you're going like left to right, left to right, left to right, like, okay, you're swinging. Um, and if you see in a clock, if it comes down into the center and it's still, okay, it doesn't swing anywhere, it's just in the center. Okay, then after that, you have control over the mind. Then negative thoughts cannot overpower you because your mind is not controlling you, you are controlling your mind. Okay, so... So that's the important bit here because finally, where does this come from? Alcohol drinking from the mind, right? Because your mind is imbalanced. It's feeling all these negative things. I have nothing. Oh, I can't do anything. Negative thoughts. And then you turn towards alcohol. Okay. So, yeah. So it's a mental issue, isn't it? In the end, it's a mental issue. So you have to con take control of the mind and human body is a tool yeah. given to you to control the mind actually. The body is a tool like to control the mind because you can't control the mind directly. You can't go into the mind directly. How can you go into the mind directly and control it? You cannot do that. You know, it's, it's not uh, physical or feasible to control the mind. So, and speaking, using the tool called body, you can control it. If you are speaking the right things, if you're speaking pure principles from centered speech, then you are controlling mm -hmm. the mind. Okay, so uh, it's basically okay. mind control. So very, using the int very body. interesting. So you have two tools, right? Attention and body, right? You have two tools only as a human being. You have your attention, you have your body. Now you have to use the body in order to control the mind. mind. Okay, so speech in a human being can help them control the mind. So diction along with what you're saying. You can have sentences proper sentences which are truths universal truths which people can speak from their mouth and repeating them will take them to a correct mental state a balanced mental state and a person in a balanced mental state will not fall prey to alcohol or any other addiction okay so yeah 
and i mean That's alcohol true. doesn't taste good it's not like a fun thing it doesn't taste good you know people take alcohol to get out of it it's not a pleasant <laughs> tasting liquid oh yeah, de- yeah definitely i mean yeah yeah it can yeah it, it can be made to but i think people do drink it mainly for the effect that, that, that yeah, where yeah. they can get out of their mind more and so i can totally yeah. understand how you're saying that meditation can cure that because yeah. because in fact that's really what i think people who drink or people who take any substance they're trying to achieve some sort of that feeling of of that feeling of freedom, freedom like that of, feeling yeah. of moksha yeah get, getting away from the troubles of the mind right yeah they're trying to get away from the troubles of the mind yeah the thing is in this the thing comes back even worse because once you are, your drink goes off the whole problem comes back to you even more whatever you were running for from to take the alcohol actually when you finish when the effect finishes it comes back to you 10 times the same thing then you have to drink even more in order to so it keeps on yes. it's a vicious cycle it's a it's not a solution yeah. it's not a solution to yeah. the problem so it's not a it's not even a temporary solution it's very very like momentary little bit and then it yeah. becomes more and more difficult and the and then the body suffers okay because the body suffers and then the mind suffers even more so mm-hmm. it's a vicious cycle things get from bad to worse they don't improve using this oh, yeah yeah 